mites, tags, and confections. And I thought we would come on today to start the week off with a wreath um, using some items from the Dollar Tree. We have a two pack of the Gerber Days Eclipse and a couple packs of burlap ribbon that um, they sold in the fall. Um, they do still sell burlap ribbon on the spool. Um, it's just a little different than this. Um, and we have one of their willow wreath forms. So this should be a pretty quick wreath, hopefully. Let's go through and take this stuff off. I'm not sure if I want to make a bow with this yet or if I just want to tie some around. Kind of figure out as we go here. I'm gonna do I'm not gonna open that one just yet. Okay, I'm gonna take my flowers off here. And these are the big like um four inch flowers on the alligator clip. just going to start by um, clipping these on and see where that goes. So I like to have something that we can disassemble later and just repurpose everything. Sorry guys if you hear the noise in the background the girls our fur babies have to have a treat every time we come down to the studio and that's what they're carrying on about in the background right now. Let's see. How's that looking? Opal, please stop. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. I think we're going to go ahead and let me see if I can pull this back, guys. Oh, sorry, wrong way. I'm still learning this camera. Here we go. I think this is back as far as I'm going to be able to get it. And I'm just clipping these on these little loose um, or, yeah, vines, the willow vines. got a third color but I wanted to keep it simple have one left I might as well tuck that one up here well that was pretty painless simple bow. Do I want to do a fluffy bow? And I think with the flowers being simple, I'm probably just going to go simple. And there, all I have is just this rolled up on top of itself back and forth a couple of times. I'm going to lay that aside. Let's cut off some for a tail. Fold 
this in a little bit. I'm just going to make a simple knot back here. under. I'm not worried that it's not perfect. Kind of the whole reason of using the burlap. And then that can very easily be untied and reused. So then I will just put some wire on there and wire, wire that on. And let's see if I can pull this up a little bit. There we go, guys. No, it's not fitting in there real well. Yeah. yeah, it's as far out as I'm going to be able to go. But there we go. We have what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven dollars. Seven dollars in wreath. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, seven dollars in under five minutes and we have a cute little summer wreath so i will get some still pictures of this hanging and put them here at the end and hopefully this gave you a quick idea for a quick wreath for your summer door take care guys and have a good day bye